what, what the lady's is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Donald Trump, your president, is the absolute worst president in U.S. history, according to political experts. The current incumbent of the White House finished dead last in a survey of political scientists, while his predecessor, Barack Obama, finished number eight. A couple of slave owners finished at the top. Abraham Lincoln, number one, George Washington, number two, followed by Franklin D. Roosevelt at number three. The survey was based on the views of 170 members of the American Political Science Association's Presidents and Executive Politics section and was published in the New York Times. Trump has taken the place of James Buchanan, who was in charge when the U.S. plunged into civil war, at the very bottom of the list. I know what you're saying. You're like, man, you got to tell me. I already know he was the worst. You know, electing a draft dodger is never a good idea, especially electing somebody who is a draft dodger for president. See, he'll try to live vicariously through soldiers and start his own war. That's why you want a military parade. Can't have a military parade if you ain't got your own war. Got to put your name on a war. Trust me, y'all. America is going to enter a war before he's out of office. I can guarantee you that. I know what some of y'all are thinking. Well, the experts said that Hillary was going to win. Well, the experts didn't take into account that Trump was working with Russia to fix the election. Let's lay it all the way out there, man. Trump got to start a war. He got to start a war. He'll do anything to be loved. Man, ain't that something? You got all of that money. And you're the most hated person in the world. Ain't that something? I guess it's true when they say money can't buy you love. 170 political science experts has concluded that Trump is the worst president ever. Don't take an expert to figure that out. The demander and thief is clearly trash. If the next 10 presidents were 10 years old, Donald Trump would still be the worst president ever because he is a petulant child, a bully, and a village idiot all rolled up into one. His mama should be embarrassed and his daddy should have pulled out. No more talk. What the lady's talking about.